Hello guys, my name is Amiza and welcome to this untold story of mine. This video is requested by some of you guys on my Instagram but first of all, I would like to apologize if this is not what you guys are expected. I think almost um, 90% of this journal is gloomy and depressing. Um, I started this journal back in 2018. That was when I went through a very bad breakup. I didn't plan to have this art journal at first because I actually misbought this notebook. Like I didn't mean to buy it but now it has a significant meaning to me. And as I said, um, I had this notebook back in 2018 and at that time, my mental health was nowhere near okay to say the least. I struggled a lot, I had problems sleeping at nights, I tried to reach out to the people around me but all they said was I should stop feeling sad, that I should just move on and I shouldn't be sad about the breakup thing, like my feelings were not valid. So I spent most of the nights crying like an idiot, alone, and tried to comfort my own self that this too shall pass, and that was when I grabbed this journal. So I would turn to this journal whenever I felt like I needed a place to let that feelings out of my chest, this journal literally witnesses all of my sadness, disappointment, I let all of that emotions out. Sometimes I cried while painting or drawing in this journal. Remembering how I fought those days is something that still makes my heart feel unease because I still can remember the pain I went through every time I flipped through the pages in this journal. Maybe that is one of the reasons why I was hesitated to share this art journal with you guys. I used this journal mainly to express my own feelings because at least I had a place where nobody can judge me for whatever feelings I felt at that time. Some of the drawings and most of the quotes you saw in this journal are actually inspired or copied from the internet and Pinterest. I also use this journal to experiment with new medium or supplies I have on hand and also to experiment with new techniques. This journal is a mess. It is nowhere near my bullet journal which is mostly neat and minimal like what you guys always see on my Instagram account but I kind of like it this way as I said I mostly drew something in this journal whenever I felt sad or I needed to express my feelings I needed to um, let the feelings out so I didn't really strive for perfection in this journal I am feeling a lot better now. If you guys ask me, I thought of throwing away this journal at first, but then I decided not to. Maybe I will not flip through the pages in the near future. Maybe it will just sit in the shelf collecting dust. I don't know. Only time can tell. I already bought a new notebook which will be used as my second art journal. Hopefully this second one will not be as gloomy as this one. kind of scared to be honest because I don't usually share my personal story online 
I am scared of showing this vulnerable side of me. But if I were to give you guys some advices on this, please, 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 if someone you know is struggling, reach out to them. Let them know that they are not alone. If they come to you to share their stories, don't dish them. Give them emotional support and most of all, allow them time to grieve. Allow them time to be sad. There is no time limit for grief. Some problems may seem small to us. Broken engagement maybe is just a small issue to some people. But please remember that we all deal with problems differently. If you can't understand their struggles, the least you can do is lend them a shoulder to cry on. Let them know that you are there for them. Remember that we are all humans. We are allowed to have emotions. For those of you who was there and support me when I hit rock bottom, I can't thank you all enough. I am very grateful to have you. You know who you are. And looking on the bright side, if it wasn't because of this experience, I will never be where I am now, I will never be who I am today, I will never find this beautiful bullet journal community, this community really has teached me a lot, I will never found all these beautiful souls and kind people who always show their support towards me and I mean it when I say I really appreciate each and every one of you. And to those of you who are struggling right now, please remember that you are not alone. Don't give up because you too deserve to be happy. Alright, so that's what this art journal is all about. This is the untold story of mine that I am now showing to everyone who watched this video. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye.